on Jenu Matenge Road, a few, a few plots from my own uh, Kwacha office, that that plot, which we went in 2018 to complain that there are some fraudsters who are taking it away, that suddenly now we are the culprits. I want to tell you here now, I'm not even a director or shareholder. I don't even exist in that company. There is a previous police report from the same DCI that is lodged in court that, uh, that charges the culprits. So you wonder what are these things that are coming up all of a sudden. It has nothing to do with the property. Just like uh, guns a few years ago, it is purely just a persecution. These are lies, lies about crimes we know nothing about. Could you prob probably be linking it that the DCI is hitting back at you because of the court case about the guns? Right now the DCI is a convict. He has no rights to put anybody in handcuffs. But you're in handcuffs. Yes, he has no right. And the courts will adjudicate that. He is a convict. He was convicted last year. He's the one who should be in committee. He was even sentenced. This is just total rubbish. There is a bigger picture here and it has to do with elections. After all, why is it every election, it is Jimmy that is sought. 2017, I'm being looked for. 2022, now suddenly. In between that, there's no problem. It is about the elections. This weekend, we are about to launch a national, a, a special uh, uh, delegate congress where we had called about 2,000 people, delegates of ODM, to give notice, 21 days notice, as per the constitution of the party for a delegate congress to elect the president of the party within 21 days. That was to happen this coming weekend on Sunday. Were you in a no, bunker? No, no, why would I be in a bunker? How are you surviving in Sunday? Sorry? How are you surviving in Sunday? We were fine. We were fine. We drank water. We are fine. We haven't eaten, but we drank water and we've been okay.